Let's crawl. Oh shit, I heard a shot. Someone is shooting. Hey, this tutorial might end real early. Someone's taking shots. I don't know if it's at us or at the zombies, but we gotta get the hell into those trees. That's the worst thing you can hear is shots fired, because you know it's another human. And they're not as dumb as the zombies. Now technically, we wouldn't have lost much. If we die, we'll spawn somewhere on the coast. But we won't have our Winchester. Okay, I'm gonna risk it. Just bolt. So anyways, that was Frigorodki. And I think we accomplished our first mission, which was to get a new weapon. And we have a new weapon. We're alive. We lost 2,000 health, but what the hell. Fifteen slugs in each magazine. So, our new mission is to hit another barn, which is just west of this one. It's on the northeast end of Cherno. Now, Cherno is a pretty crazy place, too. It's like Electro. You want to avoid it. Unless you want to go player versus player and die a lot. The next barn we can't quite see from here, but it's approximately over there. I'm going to run through those trees here to get to that clump of forest to hit it from the north. Oh, you can see it. It's right by that tree.
That's our objective. So this will be another barn raid. There's only one here that we're interested in or going into. You'll get pretty familiar with these soon enough. relax and catch your breath. If you're on like a expert or regular type of server, you'd see a crosshair and it would be dancing all over the place because we're a little out of breath. So it's always good to catch your breath so you can aim better. Good, nothing on this side. Makes it easy. Hopefully there's nobody in there. And again, I'm using the Makarov because if I have to fire, I don't want the shot to ring out. If I shot right now, That guy crawling wouldn't hear it, but if I used the Winchester, he would probably come running and join the fray. So always pick your weapon. Barn raid number two. I check the bottom all the time. Hopefully there's nobody up there. We got a hatchet already. That would be used to fuel a helicopter or a car. Getting lucky here. No zombies around. No loot either. 
Here's my trick. I like to look down there, and I don't have to walk around the haystack. Garbage. And we'll check the other side. Whoops, don't run. An arrow and two empty cans, a jerry can. Oh, shit, someone's firing. Let's get the fuck out of here. Sounded like he was coming that way. I'm just going to go full out. Last thing we want is to get jumped after all that walking. So anyways, we're heading north. We're getting away from the coast. Uh, those weren't too productive, but we got a rifle. I would have liked more food. There's another barn up here. We're going to hit this next barn, and then next destination is Zelenogorsk. Remember... Remember, our major destination is going to be the airfield. But Zelenogorsk is our next major one, and in between then we're going to hit a few towns. Or we might skip them. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm going to go back to my regular crouch run. You can run if you like. I just like the crouch. It's a little slower, but fuck it. So there's uh, the barn. We're going to hit that. And then we're going to follow the power lines all the way to pretty much Zelenogorsk. Uh, there's... A media little town on the way and a tiny town on the way. If we knew to, we'll hit them. Don't know what we'll do yet. Zombie on the left. So, same as last time. I really want beans. I want to get up to 1,200 health. Well, it looks like we might have flicked out again. We have an easy access, easy entrance. Same as usual. Check the f ground floor first, then we'll do each side. Nothing we're really interested in, but I took a heat pack. 
Just so we have one. Yeah, I'll take, uh... I'll take both of them. She has to drop the heat pack. I want space in my inventory. See, I only have two slots left there. Aha! Jackpot. Frank and beans and sardines. What could be better? Oh, and then... 1911 mag and that's my favorite gun for my pistol so I'm gonna grab that it dropped one of my Makarov mags see that happen but I'm anticipating so I'm grabbing the 1911 ammo now that's garbage Nothing down there, nothing up here. Something across the way. Looks like garbage down there. Bandage and Makarov. I got two bandages. I'm good for now. Oh, let's look at her pack. Let's open her bag. Oh, that's another thing. Don't open your bag while you're looking at that. Anyways, the inventory is kind of clunky. Open bag. Oh, I've, I haven't put anything in it. Well, let's eat this food, because I need it. Now I like to always save one can, because we're doing long distance stuff, so when I get a flashing red food thing, I'd like to have something to eat. But I eat those two to bring me up to 1100 blood. Okay, we're, we're cooking, we're cooking. Uh, let's put shit that we don't need in here, like uh, flares. So remember, the right is our regular inventory, so let's put a road flare in there. See how it frees up the space? I like to have two bandages on me, so we'll leave them. Uh, let's put the beans in there. That's emergency reserve. And that's about it. We don't have enough stuff yet to worry about inventory management too much. How come I got a crosshair now? One in doubt, crawl. Okay, we want to get up to the power lines and follow them. 